Morning Poweristas, it's Alex Worley and I am joined by stand-up comedian Heather McDonald. You probably saw her in Chelsea lately, maybe you listened to her podcast, Juicy Scoop. Hey Poweristas, it's Alex Worley and I am joined by fitness evangelist Angela Davis. Hi. Who just got done shooting with Oprah, no big deal, the 21 days of motivation and movement and that was just really a pre-shoot for what you're doing, this new Amdio method. So Absolutely. tell me about your method in general. So the Amdio method um, is Angela Manuel Davis change from the inside out. Um, so for me, it's all about changing from the inside. That is one of the things she promotes, is fabulousness. So what does fabulousness mean to you, first of all? Well, fabulous means really living life to the full, mm -hmm. wherever you're at in life. A lot of people have the concept that fabulousness is about, like, nice cars and money <laughs> and, like, running around and being a rock star. And that's all really great. But I, I think it's in your think, budget. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's in your budget. And I think it's really important that you actually rock fabulous wherever you are. So you just did it. I just did it. Sometimes that's what it's all about is just, just having a vision, yeah. not necessarily knowing Don't even exactly think about what it. you're you doing. Jump in. Just jumping yeah. in like a cold pool. How do you make beauty empowering? How do you sprinkle that into your salon, for instance? I live. I, I do me. And when you see me and you're around me enough, you're like, um, I want a little bit of that. <laughs> Advice you would give a woman watching that has big goals and high standards and wants to go for her dreams, what is the number one piece of advice? I would say be willing to take the risk. Taking the risk is huge and you have to do it. You can't get to your goals. And it's going to be scary. Exactly. Make no mistake, it's it is going, going to be scary. To be really the scary. fear it's never really goes away. <laughs> it never goes away. I'm still scared every day. Yeah. What is your definition of empowerment? Knowing your purpose, being able to be patient with yourself, and to express that purpose and let others be um, inspired by it and contribute to you by you being who you are. The more no's I got, um, the stronger I felt and the more the vision expanded. And it, I was at that point that I was, I mean, I felt so great after a year of tough work. Um, <laughs> and that goes to show that so much of entrepreneurship is mental because mm -hmm. you were telling me that so much of it has just been believing in yourself. Yeah. And you're young, can we tell people your age? Yes, I'm 25 now. 25, you started this journey when you were 23. Right. Um, being a woman in the tech industry, a male dominated industry, there were lots of right. things that people could have taken on as mental hurdles. What advice do you have for someone who is so anxious and feels the pressure to meet someone? Because I think a lot of women have this idea that I need to be married by this age and I need to have kids by this age and I need to be in a good marriage in order to have those kids. So yeah. what advice would you have for that person that's maybe feeling that pressure? So we oftentimes have this fairy tale of what life should look like. I'm going to get married a certain age to my Prince Charming I'm gonna buy a beautiful home. I'm gonna have all of these beautiful kids. I'm going to be swept off my feet. It's gonna be so fun. Okay, that fairy tale does not exist, actually. Um, I love the specificity in that intention yes. because that's a mistake I made right out of college is I would go for the, I can do this, I can do that, I can do that. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm a chameleon, I can yeah. do anything. Place me anywhere, you Girl, know? Well, you're talking to everybody, you're talking to nobody, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. Exactly, yeah. exactly. So there's so much power in just owning, first of all, knowing what you want, yeah. which is a battle in and yes. of itself, yes. but then also owning what you want too, right? Yes.